In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to set up MetaMask for the Polygon network so you can buy and manage your Coach coins. I'm here in my Chrome browser. You can use any Chromium browser that you want. So Chrome, Brave, Edge, any other browser like that will work Chrome. So what we're going to do is you're first going to set up MetaMask. We're going to install it. And MetaMask is a browser extension. So to set up MetaMask, we go up here to these dots and then we scroll down to more tools and we go to extensions. We don't have any extensions because this is a brand new Chrome installation, but we want to find extensions. So we click on the Chrome web store. And then here we go to search the store. We type MetaMask and now we have MetaMask here. So we click that and then we click add to Chrome. And then add extension. And now you can see that is welcome to MetaMask and you have a introductory um, thing here. So you can either go through this introductory thing and click get started. So let's go ahead and do that first, get started. And we first need to create a wallet. You probably don't have a wallet this time. So we need to create a MetaMask wallet. The wallet is going to um, hold all of your keys to all of your tokens. So let's first create a wallet and get a wallet set up. Help improve MetaMask, um, blah, blah, blah. Nah, let's not do that, it doesn't matter. All right, so we put in a password, minimum eight characters. All right, I've done that. I've written agree, create. Okay, now it says you can secure your wallet. So in MetaMask, you have a password and you have a recovery phase. The recovery phase allows you to get access to your MetaMask wallet if you ever forget your password. So I wanna go click next. And then we need to review my secret. So this is very, very important. You need to copy this out somewhere and either write it down on a piece of paper or put it in some kind of secure location on your computer. If any malicious person has access to this secret backup phrase, they can just drain all of your wallet. So make sure that this is never given out, never able to be accessed by anyone else but you. All right, next it's going to say, Please select a phrase in order to make sure it is correct. So this is going to just confirm that we have already um, copied this out and we know what it is. So I'll go ahead and then confirm this here. All right, once I've done that, it says I've proved that I know my recovery phrase. I can click all done and we should be all done. So it just gives you some more information about this. We're not gonna go over this here. So we'll click out of here. And now that you see this is your MetaMask. Now you're typically not going to be seeing it in this big window like this. So if you go over here and we'll close all these, it now will show up as a Chrome extension in your Chrome extensions page. Now to see it show up, by default, it may not show up and available. It's, a, it's actually a Fox, so we need to make it available here in the toolbar. So do that, we click on this as the extensions and we see MetaMask, we click on this little pin. And now you can see that the MetaMask icon um, shows up here. So this is where you would access it typically. So if you click on it, and it's going to first prompt you to log in with your password. It will reset every time you restart your computer, I believe, and there's other sometimes when it resets, so you have to uh, um, unlock it with your password. It's not all the time, but it will prompt you to log in every now and then with it. So we click on unlock, and now we are here. This is MetaMask. Now, it's all set up and you now have a wallet on the Ethereum mainnet and each of these test networks. Don't worry about this for this tutorial. We're going to be focusing on Polygon only because Coachcoin is not on Ethereum. So to get access to the Polygon network, we need to connect it to the Polygon network. To do that, we go over here to custom RPC. The RPC URL is essentially an entry point to that particular network or to that particular blockchain. Um, it allows you to work with um, the tokens. It's essentially a one entry point to the, uh, um, to the network. So, all right, for the network name, you can type anything you want here, but typically you just type in, I don't know, Polygon. And for the RPC URL, there are many different RPC URLs that you'll see out there but the best one by far is polygon-rpc.com. This is essentially an RPC aggregator, which behind the scenes connects to many different RPC URLs 
to make sure which one is congested. If they're congested, it'll go to the next one. It'll go to the next one. So it's a very reliable um, RPC. So we definitely recommend polygon-rpc.com. And then for the chain ID, the chain ID of Polygon is always going to be 137. And the currency signal for Polygon is going to be Matic. It is the Matic token. For Ethereum, it is ETH. For the Polygon network, it is going to be Matic. So make sure that's there. And the Block Explorer is polygonscan.com. The Block Explorer is the website that you can go to to see your various transactions on um, Polygon. It's just like um, Etherscan on the Ethereum network, but Polygon Scan is the place where you can see all of your transactions and all the different wallets and activity on the network. All right, so now that we've got all this information in here, we click on Save. And now you can see that we have the Polygon network in here. We can close off of networks. And now you can see we have Polygon here. This is the network switcher. So we want to click on this. If this is ever on Ethereum mainnet, you see that it changes to ETH. And we want to go to Polygon. All right. And once you set up the Polygon network, you are good to go. You can then connect your wallet to sites like codefarm.io. And to connect your newfound wallet to codefarm.io, you click on connect up here, MetaMask, provide the account, the wallet that we have are here, view the addresses of your minute account, it's just going to view at this time, essentially just connecting, this is common, and click next. And now you can see that it is connected at this point. You can buy, sell, do whatever you want with Coach Farm. And you begin staking on Coach Farm and do essentially do whatever you want with your uh, wallet.